It doesn't matter what Josh said. All right, that sex tape is when all our problems started. Okay, can we stop calling it that? It makes it sound like you guys willingly made one. Yeah, you're right, we didn't. It's revenge porn, which is a crime, and Esme should rot in jail for it. Everything was perfect before that. Okay, you're right in that I can't fix this for you, but you know that I've had my fair share of experience with heartbreak, right? And I'm not gonna pretend to know how things were with you and Joss. Maybe everything was perfect before that video came out. But in my experience, rarely is it just one thing that breaks up a couple. Maybe it's just easier to blame the breakup all on Esme. I mean, God knows she played a big role, so it must feel like she is responsible for everything. And it's, it's easy to look at one catastrophic event and be like, yeah, that was it. Trust me, I've been there. But you will only drive yourself crazy if you keep asking yourself, what if this had never happened? If Esme didn't make the revenge porn, if Trina never went to trial, if none of those things ever happened, I am certain that Jocelyn and I would still be together. But Cameron, if you, if you really think about it, there were other issues too. Like, didn't you keep Spencer's secret that he was only pretending to believe Esme and you didn't tell Jocelyn? Regardless of the reasoning, that hurt the communication between the two of you. Maybe. It still doesn't make it hurt any less. I know. I know, I know. I, she was your first girlfriend. She was your first love. It's gonna hurt. But I also know that one day you'll be able to look back at the time you had with her and instead of feeling all of this pain, you'll feel grateful for what you did have. Thanks for the talk, Mom. Even if you didn't like what I had to say? You were just telling me the truth. If I continue to blame Esme for Jocelyn breaking up with me, it's just gonna fuel my anger. But now that I'm realizing that Jocelyn and I both played parts in us ending, this just makes me sad. I'm so sorry. All right, Mom, I gotta finish up here. Okay, wait, wait, before you go, I wanted to remind you that I love you and I'm always here for you. Hey, Mom, I love you too.